Hey everyone, it's NJ. I had a day with NJ and it is New Year's Eve right now. So I hope everyone's going to um, have a great New Year's Eve and Happy New Year to you. So today, Amar and I went shopping for calendars for the girls and then I stopped at Office Depot um, to see if maybe they had the Erin Condren planners there because I am a procrastinator and did not order the planner that I wanted. Um, I was planning on doing the Erin Condren planner. So anyways, they did not have that there, but they had the Inkwell Press and I was, you know, looked at it at the store and as I was looking at it, I was thinking, you know what, this probably is going to work well for me. So I went ahead and purchased it. I believe this the planner was $49 and then the Be Well Fitness Log was $20. Um, so I was just going to go ahead and page through it with you guys and show you what's on all the pages and all that stuff. So when I got home, of course at the store I looked through it a little bit, but when I got home um, I really went through it in depth and I got really, really excited because I think it's going to fit my needs perfectly. Um, so anyways, this is what I'm doing on my New Year's Eve. I'm sitting down with my planners and um, once I'm done filming this, I'm probably going to sit down and start planning out my uh, 2017. So that's very exciting. Um, so the, the colors are kind of a peach color, a mint green bluish color, and some grays. And then it has like a wood green color. Um, texture pattern to it um, with some gold and then the coils are actually gold they're kind of showing up silver here though but they are they are gold um, so let's just go ahead and page through it and I'll kind of give you a first look at it so right when you flip it open it has the little um, six inch ruler I believe is what it is with um, just a little pattern there it says today is your day and then it has a quick and simple setup guide here, kind of going over how you can use it, um, the pages. And then it also says, sign up to watch our series of free setup videos to help make your planner work best for you. So I'll definitely check that out um, sometime this next week. Um, so then I turn it here and uh, 2017, this will be your best year yet, where you can put your name and everything. And then it has a couple of pages here that um, it says important dates, big events, and happenings. So, you know, you can use it for uh, vacations that you have planned out or weddings or, like it says, big events. Um, and then you turn the page and it has goals. And I'm really excited about this. I think it's a beautiful layout and um, really has all the things I want to work on in this coming new year. So it has 2017 mission. And then... Your goals, it has personal, social, financial, health, home, and it says dream big. And then it has quarterly goals, break break them down, achieve your dreams. It has three months, six months, nine months, and 12 months. And then the colors kind of correspond with the colors over here. Turn the page and it has um, a year at, year at a glance, um, 2017. And um, you get into the next page is January, so it's a month, the monthly spread on two pages, um, and then it has top five over here with little bubbles, and then a section for notes. And then you turn the page, and it has the mission board, which I, I'm really liking this, and I'm excited to fill it in. It has me time, social, home, health, financial dream big and then a couple of blank ones that you can use for other items and then it has a section for plan focus and then a daily habit tracker for the month um so it has a section for three different habits that you want to track for the month and then little uh things that you can check off or fill in okay so then the weekly spread it goes from monday through Sunday. On the first page on the left, it's Monday through Thursday, and then the weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday on the other page. Um, it does not have the separated boxes, which I'm used to from the Erin Condren, but I think I'm going to like this as well. And then it has um, just the shading down here of three separate boxes, which I'll use one probably for meals, and then it might all be for meals. I'll see. i got to kind of play around and think about how I'm going to use that. 
and that has a weekly focused and then a note section and the paper feels really nice um, so that's nice so it has that for all the months but as I was going through this is why I started getting excited um, for at the end for all the little extra pages here Oh, I forgot to also say at the end of each month it has notes and ramblings. It has this at the end of each month. Um, so after the last weekly spread, it has this and it has like a um, just kind of a dot pattern on that. That's nice for actual space at, at each month. Okay, so this I'm excited for for next Christmas is what I'm going to use it for. I don't think I'll use it for birthdays. I think I'm pretty much going to use it for Christmas stuff. Um, that's the main thing I buy gifts for other than the kids' birthdays. Um, so it has the gift list, better check it tw twice, and then shopping for ideas, item purchased, and how much you spent for each. Um, and then it has ideas for me. Um, and then the next page, not all those who wander are lost. So this I love because usually when I'm planning a vacation, I write notes on random pieces of paper and then they get lost. It, it will be so nice to have this in my planner. So it has the where to, how many nights, dates, um, airline information, um, like the returning stuff, the accommodation information, and then things um, not to forget and all that. So I just, I think this is so wonderful. And it has three of those little sections. And this, see, this is what I mean. I got so excited as I was turning the page. So this page has coming soon movie night, great films on this top half, and then good books to read. Now, if you know me at all, the my two loves, other than my kids and my husband and my family and all that, are movies and books. So this is going to be so fabulous. I was actually thinking about making um, my favorite movies of 2016 and favorite books I've read of 2016 videos. So leave a comment below if maybe you would be interested in that. Um, I know it'll be kind of late, a week late doing those. but um, So I go to tons of movies and I read a lot of books. So that I was really excited for. And then on this next page next to it, it has a monthly bill tracker. And that's one of my big goals this year is to be like keeping track of our finances big time. So um, this I was very, very excited for as well. And it's nice because a lot of planners don't have this sort of thing in, in them. Usually you have to buy a separate planner for that. So that and then it has just some um, blank pages at the end here. And it's kind of got the grid pattern on it. And then it has the 2018 year at a glance and a um, pocket on this side, a place for everything, everything in its place. So on the next page, it has a pocket as well. And then it has um, a pocket on the back here. Um, so that's nice as well. But that's kind of a look at the planner. I am really excited to start filling it in for all of my goals for 2017 which pretty much this covers it so um the financial goals fitness goals fitness and health goals and um oh what are my other and um keeping up with my house <laughs> goals um organization type things so i'm really excited to get started in that now this one was there and it has it's a be well fitness log um and it's a 12 week of exercise and exercise and food logs so I'll use it for three months and see how I like it if I really like it then I'll go ahead and buy one for the next uh, three months but it of course has the quick and simple setup guide to help you again um, and it looks like it has videos on that how how to use it and just ideas um, so it has uh, get in shape 12 week battle plan. So that's kind of cool and exciting. And so what's your motivation, workout goal, nutrition goal, personal goal? How will you reward yourself? And then it has area for all the measurements, um, weight and all that stuff. And then it says plan and attack. Uh, so this is like making your workout plan um, for the 12 weeks for every day over those 12 weeks. Um, which is nice and then it has the first week each week is laid out this way where you have room for the date 
um, and then today's focus and has for anything that you want to do. So if you're doing strength fitness or cardio, it has intensity, time, distance, um, calories burn, um, things for resting heart rate, if you keep track of that. Um, and then it also has like if you do weight training. Um, so if you're doing weights and you can circle like what you're doing um, for arms, back, chest, core, legs, shoulders. So if you're into lifting weights, which the first three... The, in the beginning, I'm going to focus mainly on cardio, but then later on I'll move into more weights. Um, it has the water intake there, and then it has all the food you eat. And I even this I was excited about because this is exactly how I would plan my food. Breakfast, snack, lunch, snack, dinner, and then even it has a spot for a late snack. And then calories, points, and then rating if you want to do like a rating system. So that's the individual dates. Um... So you go through the, all the days for that week, and then it has a week one checking in. How are you doing? Um, so it goes into like how you felt for the week. Um, did you meet your weekly goals? Um, good news, not so good news, and what you want to focus on for the next week. And then it goes into the next week. Um, so that goes through all the weeks. Week 12, checking in, which should be the, the last week in the book because it goes through 12 weeks. If I can get the page turned here. <laughs> All right. I'm missing a page here. Okay. And then it has a finish line. You did it. Um, and then you can do your measurements and all that stuff that you started off in the beginning. And most successful about going to keep up with and reward yourself again. And then back here it has 100 calorie ideas for food, which is kind of neat. Um, if you get in a rut and you need some food ideas for just 100 calories, that's kind of cute and nice. Um, but there's that. So I'm going to go ahead and try that out as well because that's one of my main goals. goals um, one of my main goals this year. But I just I was excited about them. And like I said, I'm going to start planning on them right now as soon as I get done filming this. So thank you guys so much for watching. And maybe once I start filling in a little bit more, I will do like a check-in and show you how I'm using it and if it's working real well for me or not. So um, thanks for watching. And I hope you guys have a great 2017. See you next time. Bye-bye.